Hello and good morning y'all and welcome back to Tower Unite. So now this video I really want to get the golden melons over on Heavenscape. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. I did look up in advance on uh, where they are because I tried doing this again um, on a prior take of this video and I could not find it and I was going crazy. So I said screw it let's just redo the video. Try and be a little more entertaining and less wondery about this. And uh, basically what I'm saying is I cheated and I know where the melon I missed the first time I tried this is. So um if you watched the video uh, when I covered this track when it first came out, uh, I found the melons on levels 8 and 11, but I could not find the first one. The first one is going to be on level 3 on this like little random like grassy patch after a boost pad, which I was pretty sure I searched for before, but I guess not. So we're going to go ahead and rush through this, and then after that, I don't know what I'll do. I'll see if any of the game worlds have people in it, in games I want to play, on maps I want to do. And if not, you know, we'll just kind of do plaza shenanigans, because, um... There's no real workshop condos to check out right now, and honestly, I just wanted to play some tower. I've been working on some other videos, as I typically do. Uh, one is just about ready to kind of like see the light of day, but it's not like a big crazy video. It's, it's a very simple basic video. So... I just I wanted to break from making that, and then I want to go back into the longer form video again. Hopefully, like a little bit more rejuvenated, like in a week or two. Wait, there it is. That's where it is. It's on that grass patch. I was like, I, this looks like the screenshot. Okay, so there's melon once. Now we just gotta worry about levels um eight and eleven. I believe it is. I think it's eight and eleven. Hold, I'm gonna tab out and double check. Yeah, it's eight and eleven. Okay. Yeah, right now I'm just kind of a little bit busy, so like I haven't like really been able to kind of get back in the big videos. I've just been doing like a lot of shorter videos and stuff. Um, because my Twitch team, the Mellow Fellows, are currently doing a charity event, raising for the American Heart Association. I did my two streams raising, and now I have a lot of other members of my team, 12 more, currently raising uh, over the course of the week. And I'm in charge of like promoting that and trying to like keep that all running smoothly. And so far, it's going pretty good. I think as I'm recording this, we just passed like the $680 like, threshold raised in like 24 hours or something, which is really cool. It's like where all my energy is, but I'm kind of wiped. I've been waking up early and stuff and I'm staying up a little bit late to make sure I get like all the promo out. After this week is done, I can kind of like relax. I can breathe a bit. I'm excited for that. I do like breathing. Shockingly enough. Okay, anything outside of like doing the charity stuff? Like, is there anything new with me? Not really. I'm trying to think. Um, I played this really. I played two really awesome games recently. Actually, I played this first one. It's called Driftwood, which is like you're a sloth, but you're also a skateboarder. So it's like not like a super like stunt heavy game. It's really about like traveling downhill and like drifting and avoiding traffic and going down like these big like swervy paths. And trying to keep a combo going uh, by like drifting around and like running through leaves, um, like all this other stuff. It's just it's just a cool like downhill solo skateboarding game with like a score tag drifty element to it. Really good, really just awesome. It's only an early access, but like the content that's there right now is pretty damn good. And then I played this other great game called uh, the Tartarus Cake. Now, the Tartarus Key is like this, um, imagine if Supermassive Games, uh, the makers of Until Dawn and, like, Dark Pictures Anthology in the Quarry, uh, decided to make a horror escape room game. Come on, the melon up here? Yeah. Uh, decided to make a horror escape room game. So basically, uh, in a PS1 aesthetic. So basically, you get your PS1 style graphics, it's in first person, uh, there's a bunch of different characters that can all live or die. Almost like in a sauce, like almost like in a sauce sense, like where people will die if you don't solve puzzles correctly and get them out of danger. And depending on who lives and dies, like the story does transform quite a bit. And it's pretty long. There's a bunch of different like branching endings that you can get. Uh, but you're just kind of going around doing these like really like I shouldn't say convoluted, like the puzzles themselves are actually really good and make a lot of sense. There's like only like two I got tripped up on out of like 40 or 50 in that game. And it's like all escape room style. Like you gotta keep on finding a way to kind of get through these rooms. And you gotta solve the puzzles in the rooms to get out of them. Awesome, awesome game. So if you like escape rooms, if you like the Saw series, if you like super massive games, 
and you want like a combination of all those things, Tartarus Key is like, mwah. It's a chef's kiss of a game. Anything else going on with me? Uh, not really. I'm very hungry. I've been uh, trying like a new fast because I've uh, been keeping up with my diet as well as I can. But um, just stuff isn't quite going as, uh, I shouldn't say as quick as I hope. Because I don't expect this to be super quick, but it's not going quite in the way I was hoping. So I figured if I amped up my fast a bit, it, we might be going a little bit better. So I'm on a 24 fast, uh, which right now we're kind of like at the 19 and a half hour mark. So I'm probably going to order some food uh, from this like pretty healthy halal place by me. Get myself a chicken, lamb, salad, rice bowl thing and some sweet corn. That might be the play today. Get some calories in me. Um, but... This fast is also just very hard for me to kind of, like, adjust to. Hey, there's a melt. So you might as well just finish this up. Uh, just, it's a little bit tricky to, like, adjust to a 24. I might actually scale it back to, like, an 18.6. We'll see. I can do an 18.6 easy. A 24... Tw a 24 is not something I stick with for long. It's just kind of, like, kickstart my body into doing the things I want to do. And typically it works. I've done it a few times, but the, the days I'm on it, it gets a little bit tricky, like, around this time. But I think, like, a couple more days days of this, like, my body should kind of, like, get into the, the rhythm I needed to be in. Is that maybe, like, why I'm super low energy at the moment? But you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? You know. Alright, where am I going? That's where I started. Is that where I started? I got I got so lost and sidetracked here. Here we go. This is where I gotta go. My brain just did not want to register this. There we go. Ooh. I'm great at this game, by the way. Cool. I already forgot what I was talking about. I think the fast, but yeah. Yeah, I'm fine again. I'm only gonna do this like a couple of days. Probably like two or three more after this. So I started doing it, I think, like two days ago. It's like almost like a week of it. Five days of it. Six days of it. Should be good enough. For what I need. Go up here. Over here. Oh god, I should have committed. God damn it. <laughs> I'm trying to think if there's like anything else crazy going on with me, because I'm just not fully sure if there is. I've been living a very, like, just very mundane, boring life as always. Um, hmm. Is there anything? I don't know, man. Working on videos, but like I'm always working on videos, and like the videos I've been putting out, like obviously are just very short let's play content, but I've been working on like a a bigger video where I'm going back and revisiting some itch games I played before, checking out their updates. Then I still want to make my retro videos, but the retro videos I had to completely scrap. I'll try them again, like, when I have time. I'm not going to stress over it all too much. I'm not going to play mini golf where you just, we just did ball race. No one's in this. No one's in this. No one's in this. No one's in that. Okay. It's very slow. It's uh, 10.45 in the morning right now as I record, so... Not many people on, so I guess we'll just kind of head into the, um, the plaza. That's fine. We'll be a plaza gamer. We'll do trivia. Trivia will do the talking for me. That'll be the good thing. But yeah, I have, like, the retro videos I want to make, but I've tried, like, I've started and stopped that video that I've been trying to make now, like, six times, seven times at this point. And I'm just never happy with it, or I'm just not feeling it, so... Eventually, I'll kind of get in the flow, and I'll be like, yep, this is the video I want to make. It's not going to be anything outstanding, but, like, I just want to make sure it's, like, the video I like, like, I'm going to be happy with. And not the video that I feel like I have to make. So. And if it's, like, the video that kind of comes, if it comes out, like, the way I like, I can use that as, like, a branching path for, like, a ton of different, like, retro, uh, retro videos. Which sounds fun. Because I would like to branch off to that, because, uh, quite frankly, in terms of, like, itch horror games and whatnot that I've been playing... The, the well's kind of running a little bit dry. Uh, Team Fortress 2, that was 07. So. There's still stuff to do. I still have, like, a lot of games, like, left, but... Exclusive to Dreamcast? 
I don't know if I've ever heard of Pen Pen. I I play a lot of Dreamcast. Vietnam's the only country in the world starts with a V. Well, I was like, that sounds it's false, but like at the same time, maybe that maybe it's true. John Adams, Thomas Jefferson died within hours of each other. That's true. What? Hold on. No, no, no. Leave. No, we're redoing this. I'm distracting myself. Yeah, like my my itch video pool. Like while I still have a lot of stuff left to do, it's kind of like running dry. I think with like really like good quality games that I want to check out. There's a lot of like dank memory games I want to play, but you can only do that so much. I like spreading like I like putting like the memory games in there, but I need like good games like in between to kind of like separate the chaos a bit. Or at least promising ones, even if they're not great. And all I kind of got left are like very memory ones or ones that are very similar to things I've already played. Like how many of those like late night shopping like games can I play? I'm sure a shrimp, a shrimp could swim backwards. But you know? Or like how many like games I like stuck on a bus once can I play? Moonrock poisoning, really? I forget, like, the story of Portal 2. Okay. First primary weapon the player gets in Payday the Heist? Okay, so I've played Payday the Heist. But... I don't remember the gun names. I'm not, like, a gun person. Final Fantasy VI, what is the name of... Gilgamesh's weakest attack? Hell if I know. It's all the same. I'm gonna do another trivia after this. This is awful. Main pro protagonist in Ace Combat Zero? Crap. Cypher sounded the most Ace Combat I do make, so I just went with it. Which anime studio produces Sword Art Online? Sword Art's like actually something I watched. Kyoto maybe? A1? Okay. These are all things I would not, just would not know off the top of my head. Greenback is the arch nemesis of which cartoon hero? Okay. Who is Manchester United's top Premier League goals uh, scorer? That's not Wayne Rooney. I'm gonna go with um. Is it Wayne Rooney still? Wayne Rooney's a name I've heard for a long time, so I kind of figured like he would have been like um retired by now or just kind of winding down. I don't know anything about JoJo, so I just pick a random question. Tower loves JoJo questions. In the lies of Locke Lamora, what title is Locke known by in the criminal world? I don't even know what that is. Okay. I'm gonna have to try this again. <sighs> My goodness. These are hard trivia questions for things I just don't know. <laughs> but it's okay, we'll do it again. We'll do it again. We're not going to play Bloom Burst, but maybe we'll head into the arcade. I feel like I haven't done like the arcade stuff in a couple of videos. So go ahead and do it. I'm feeling it. This really was just like an excuse for me to kind of like distract myself before I get food. And um... Well, just distract myself and just kind of like take a... Take a quick breather. Tower's like a quick breather sort of thing for me. Always has been. What name did Mario from Super Mario Brothers originally have? Jumpman. Awesome. Awesome? He was Jumpman and Donkey Kong, so that's kind of like what I figured he was. And I think, wasn't Donkey Kong the first appearance of Mario? He was Jumpman. He was Jumpman. Or is that just his nickname? I'm very confused by this. Huh. Restart, because I'm not... No. <laughs> now I want to give that the goggle. The Bing. The Yahoo. The Lycos. The Dogpile. The AOL, the Ask the Jeeves. What is the capital of Indonesia? Indonesia? Ooh, Jakarta? Yeah. Which Queen song was covered in by Brittany Murphy in the 2006 film Happy Feet? Pretty love. Which issue of Sonic Hedgehog comic did Scourge the Hedgehog? Oof. That sounds like maybe like a 47 thing. 11? Okay. That's... that's so, How is that a medium? That's so specific. Which television show 
Lazy Rot. Oh, wait, Lazy Down. Who's the actor? Robbie Rotten? Uh, Stephen Carl, right? Stephen Stevenson. Oh, yay! My Little Pony, Friendship with Magic. Which of these ponies represents the quality of honesty? Uh, I don't know MLP all too well. Not really. Um, Sparkle? Applejack? I don't know. I don't know MLP, man. I know those names. I've seen them, but... League of Legends was... Not even 09, right? Yeah. Calvin Hobbs, what is the name of Susie Stuff Rabbit? <laughs> Mr. Bun. I can't remember if it was Mr. Bun or Mr. Bun Bun. In 2014 FIFA World Cup, what was the final score in the match between Brazil and Germany? Was that like a blowout? Yeah, I remember hearing that was like a blowout, like 1 7. Good. Alright. Which of these facilities was not present on the Titanic? Fainting room? I don't know what a fainting room is, so it just sounded so fancy I had to go for it. Which of these films is not set in Los Angeles? Predator 2 is New York, isn't it? Robocop? Was Predator 2 LA? I can't remember. I legit do not remember. Alright, well, let's go throw some basketballs and throw some rings. I'm definitely going a little bit slow here, but it's okay. Okay, cool. 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 I don't think I'm gonna get a hundred. I don't think I'm gonna get a hundred this time. Maybe I will. But I definitely played this a lot slower than I have been. But considering I haven't done this in a while, I'm not too. I'm not too upset with the one one ten. Honestly, that's my first super hoopers in a little while. That works for me. Cool. Noise. Noise. Ooh. It's not my best ring toss by any stretch, but so far this isn't awful. Actually, no, it's pretty bad, because I'm not even close to the, uh, the bonus, am I? Never mind, no, it's pretty bad. It's actually really bad. I thought I was way further up than I was. Damn, that was terrible. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, can we get, like, a quick dizzy? Love's a quick dizzy, right? Yeah. We love us a quick dizzy. It's Monday. Did the leaderboards reset today? 215. Let's go to 215. I don't have five tokens. I'm actually broke. That never happens. Okay. Cool. Damn it. We're not gonna... I don't think I have the reaction time right now. I think I gotta get food in me, dude. I'm gonna have to, like, end video soon just order. <laughs> I think it's about that time. Damn it. I don't think we're getting 215 here. If I can get two... Nope. All the way to level two. We'll do one more go at this. But I don't think my reaction time's there. I've been waking up too early, which means less sleep. I'll live fast on top of that. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't think I have the reaction time for this. Which is fine. Yeah, even, I can't even like, do level one, man. 
If I promise, I'm fine. It's gonna get some energy in me. Boom. Boom. Okay. 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 Alright. Ooh. Was going very good. We're over 215, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. We barely make it on. I'll take it. I'll take it barely over nothing. It's gonna be gone in a minute. And uh, let's just do it for posper posterity here. Let's do a quick candy slam. Just one that I'm gonna really go order food. Again, this video is mainly to get the golden melons into online for a quick minute. And I feel like this video served its purpose for me. And you got to hear me ramble, so that's something. But I do feel like every time I kind of go into the arcades, it's like I'm just kind of like recording reruns. Which is like why I feel like I've been trying to do it a little bit less recently, because I always go into the arcade and do the same things like this. It's fun. Damn. Oh, well, 385. I'll take it. But I really gotta get out of here. I really gotta get some food for me, because my brain is like, dude, you need to get food. So I'm gonna go ahead and go order. Get going with my day, because I still have some stuff left to do today. But I do want to thank you all very much for watching. Um, hopefully I'll catch you guys again in the next video. You all be good out here in Tower. Hopefully I'll think of some more fun stuff to do soon. Do I have, like, any more golden melons to get, actually? Let's see. Maybe we could, like, make a golden melon date again soon. I think I've got all the golden melons, but I can... I don't know. I still gotta get Event Horizon 500 melon. That's fine. Um... We still gotta do Midori golden melons. Okay. We gotta have a date with Midori and Prism. Gotcha. So maybe that'll be a plan for a new video soon. We'll see. But we're going to hop out of here, though. Uh, so thank you all very much for watching. I'll catch you guys again in the next video. Y'all have a lovely day. And as always, toodles, y'all.